point that we chose to research is how can schools better support a person or child with special needs. To start off, let me give you some quick facts and statistics that will better understand, that, are, that will help you understand why it's essential to be educated. One in five adolescents in the United States show significant symptoms of emotional distress. Sadly, though, less than 25% of those individuals receive the care they need. Surprisingly, school is one of the best places to learn about how mental health is for students and educators. And if not receiving care uh, with mental illness can lead to severe issues of growing, learning, and developing. Next, I will be discussing some cause and effect things about what schools can do to help uh, a person suffering. One thing that schools can do is they can educate staff, students, and teachers on the symptoms of a mental illness. And this would in return, now the students, teachers, and staff know how they can make a difference for an individual suffering with, from a mental illness. One final option would be for schools to hire more counselors or a psychologist. One fact that we found when we were researching was that it may take up to a week for a student to see a counselor only for a 15 minute session. And this much time can be creating more problems within the mental illness. And this would basically help because now the students would be able to see their counselors more and get the attention they need. So uh, in school, school uh, technology is a uh, negative effect on your life. And uh, if you have a, like, if you don't have too much, you have a suppressor. And uh, religion, it could uh, positively affect your health. It could, uh, if you join like, a group, it could make you feel better about yourself. And, uh, there would be a lot of stress in your life. And then uh, peer pressure, like, if your friends are like, one that really stood out and we found um, to be a good one. Schools are helping kids with mental illnesses. Um, staff getting informed on how to identify mental illnesses and inform the counselors and seek help for the kids. Schools are also taking action by bringing in mental health specialists such as psychologists and therapists to help people who need them. Our school helped me. Eastview, we, I went down to the, we went down to the counselor, Mr. Mr. Wanis. We asked about how Eastview is helping kids with mental illness. And Eastview's first line of defense is the counselor, as you can maybe expect. This counselor is talking things through with kids with mental illnesses. And we also have a school of psychologists helping out kids with mental illnesses uh, for the more serious issues, maybe. And we also have a Therapists, outside therapists and psychologists and other mental health specialists coming in to help kids with mental illness. Some causes of mental illness would be stress, such as homework, home, outside activities, just stressing you out. And also, uh, mental illness, it's in your genes. It could, it could be passed down. If your parents had a mental illness, you're, you have a higher risk of getting that mental illness. Um, also, the chemistry of your brain, um, your brain it just reacts differently in different situations and it might cause a mental illness to form. Alright, Pam, can you do an A period? Any questions or concerns you have regarding your presentation? Why do you Basically, uh, an individual that has mental illness can basically uh, feel like they're left out or not as good as someone who d does not have a mental illness. And uh, I mean, again, this could in return create more problems and stress for the student or uh, just the kid. Uh, I mean, one way we can learn it is to make more people, uh, whether I mean, it's just just everyone around us, more aware of mental illnesses because they're a very serious matter. They can have a very negative effect on a person. And then for uh, what can schools do differently to help support students struggling with mental illness? Um, for the question, what can schools do differently to help support students struggling with mental illness? Um, I feel like.
raise more awareness. 